Welcome back, everyone, to the next installment of Fatal Frame 3. We're hunting for four ghosts, and we have two of them. For real this time, we actually have two of them. So our objective is to, of course, hunt down the other two, perhaps by going through this big room and coming around the tattoo room. I wouldn't be even slightly surprised. Why don't we give that a shot? Actually, there was one thing I'm slightly curious about. My memory is a bit hazy regarding this ladder. Oh. Ah, nuts. I totally blew that one. Yeah, if there's a ghost up there, I wonder if I can, in fact, unlock that door. I'm very curious. Hold on, if I hear that sound, I wonder if that means I have to take a picture of the door. Uh oh. Oh, wow! You can actually go inside. Yeah, I hear laughter, but come on. Oh, hello. Is this a dead end? That'd be nice. Hmm, maybe not. Raincoats. A hallway I'll come to a little bit later. Definitely want this. A scroll. Hey! Oh my god, the blast function! Remember how great that was? Use L1 to operate. And it slows down how fast the ghost is repelled back, meaning it's easier to perform a fatal frame combo because it'll be closer. Wow! I actually have a reason to upgrade that camera function now. And I got the sleeping stone. I've been needing a sleeping stone. Uh oh. Ooh, three people. Huh. Creepy. Might as well check this hallway. Looks like more places have been open to us. A scaffold? Oh, that's interesting. I could get off here or keep going down. Hey, this is that lower level to the roof. Uh oh. I can't get through. That's kind of a shame. Hey, didn't I check this area in the black and white prologue? Oh, sweet. Okay, nothing to go around. There's a ladder here. Okay. Oh, really? Well, good. I found the dead end. So now I can go back to my regular exploration and then even check in the sleeping stone. Find out where I can put that. I believe there were two doors that were eligible. One of them was the roof scaffolding. The other, I honestly do not know. I guess I go back out the way I came. I'm glad I went here first. Totally worth it. This game just keeps expanding and expanding. Now I am pretty sure I want to go through here. This is the place I did not explore, right? Right, nice big room. Why, are you serious? Okay, maybe I actually need to use the, uh, sleeping stone. Who would have guessed? Huh, I'm actually really surprised. 
Actually, you know what? For morbid curiosity, I keep forgetting which doors are just locked and which ones require sleeping stones. So I'm gonna run upstairs. Now that I'm up here... Oh, that's right. There was just a dead end there. No reason. Ah, eh, what the hell. I'll save. Oh, I'm glad I finally found a use for that key, huh? Only been playing for five minutes, six minutes, and I've already made such progress. Use the key, got the blast function, this is delicious. In fact, 13,000 points. That's oh, just a spirit charge. I don't really need to worry about that after all. Upgraded lens. Ah, now that I want to upgrade. Look at that. This, I love how it shows you this room for more. How do I cycle lenses? Oops. Ah, crap. Well, that's R1. L1 is the blast. Is there a way to equip that? Bingo. There it is. Cool, now I can use that to my advantage. All of a sudden goes flying. Well, looks like I've come as far as I can go. Now to find a door that requires a sleeping stone. That might be trickier. Whoop, hold up. That was creepy. Okay, locked door, locked door. I can go through here. Maybe that was one of them. I'll check. It's so annoying. I wish they would mark things better on the map. But at least the map's accurate. And generally easy to read. Was it you? Oh yeah, I couldn't even get in there, I don't think. That was a dead end with a save point. Well, I know there's a sleeping stone door around here. But which door was it? It might have been the top floor. But I'll check down here first. No, okay, that was the chest of drawers. Oh, ooh. this door is open now. Oh my God. Um, there's nothing to see here either. I always wondered if that was a door, but I couldn't look. Dude, I'm just trapped. Oh my God. Um. Ugh. Why are you running away? Let me out. Ugh. Why is it letting me run so far? And it's not changing the camera angle at all. What the hell? This is the freakiest goddamn angle. What is going on with this game? Thank you. What the hell was... What? That was pretty awesome, but what the hell? Seriously. Ugh. That was a freaking, like, grudge monster sound, too. I don't need this. This is what I need. Wait, I can just open it? That was not the sleeping stone door. And that was the attic room. There's definitely nothing in there. Oh, this was a sleeping stone door. 
I gotta find the other. And wonder what in the hell was wrong with that freaking door. Seriously, what was that? Ugh. And why did the camera angle not change when it left? Damn game. So that's the chest of drawers. Where's another locked door? That's the chest of drawers. Go downstairs. Right. Go upstairs. Peephole room, which I can't do anything about. Man, I have no idea where the sleeping stone room is. This sucks. Could it be over here? I doubt it. I know there's that one on the rafters. I want to see if I can find that. Is there a way to zoom out? Yes. Here. How do I get here? Coming through the kimono room. Oh, Holly's room. Right. Now, where am I? Well, I guess I gotta go back downstairs. Creepy goddamn game. While I'm on my way, I should also check the projector room, just to get a grasp of where a couple of those other shots might be. Those ghosts. Alright, definitely leaving here. This hazy green glow is most unsettling. Good, I got disoriented when the camera changed on me. There we go. Let's get the hell out of here. These ghosts are really giving me trouble. I am going the right way, right? No, of course not. I'm heading right back to my start point because I'm a freaking idiot. There we go. You know, if I'm right here, I might as well check. Let's see what happens if I go to the those blue doors and just try leaving. Think anything will happen? Let's just go outside, see what happens. Aha! Uh -huh. So I can wake up at will. That's cool. And I've stolen my night clothes because I shouldn't be awake. Cool. I get to all the film at will. I'll take care of that real quick. And then I'll head back in the manner of sleep and possibly get all my inventory back. Wouldn't that be nice? I'm not sure if Miku's down here or in her room. Guess she's in her room. Oh, I gotta develop the film, duh. I'm actually not too keen on doing that. I think something's gonna happen. I'm just nervous at this house at night. I no longer trust it. Okay, nothing happened. Crowd of people standing around Yoshino. Oh, the, maybe those are the shadow people. They're berating her for something. And it's the whole group of people. Commemorative photograph. Okay, let's talk to Miku. See if she's awake for no reason. I'm like in these hallways less and less, I'm not gonna lie. Hey, how about that stain on the wall? Remember from the last installment? I really don't like the looks of that. 
Oh, well, nothing happened. I still don't like it. Did you hear that? I thought I heard something. I'm going to ignore it. I'm absolutely ignoring that. I am not pursuing anything in this house. Hmm. Miku's room. Yeah, she's chilling. Gray, what's the matter? I got photos while I was sleeping. It seems like you're having a lot of nightmares lately. Are you all right? Yes, I'm peachy. Is there something? Research this photograph. Research this photograph. I think I saw a similar photo in a collection of photos of shrines. I'll go look for it. Yay! Understood. I'll let you know if I find anything. Good, do that. Oh, I'm sorry. I blanked out for a second. I blacked out for a second? Lately, all I can think about is the past. Like back when I was a child. Ugh. It's raining again. Okay. I'm gonna go to bed. I suggest you do the same. You know what? Can I check in here? I actually can. Okay. Save again. I'm telling you, this is getting to me. I'm starting to prefer the manner of sleep to my own house. At least in the manner of sleep, I know to expect crap. My own house, you never know what's going to happen. I think we've seen this before. Yeah, we've seen that. As creepy as that is, we don't need to see it twice. So am I in the front door or what? Cool. Thanks, game. Oh yeah, that was the locked door. That is not a sleeping stone door. Oh, did the whole... Oh, the whole map reset again? That's frustrating. Well, I know I don't need to go in there. I will instead... Hmm. Yeah, okay, definitely locked. You know, I gotta wonder if, um, the ghosts are back, too. Sacred water's been reset. Or, I mean, herbal medicine's been reset. And this is the way that I do not want to go. The other way... Yeah, I guess I gotta work my way back through here. Okay, that's what I'll do. I wanna see if I can get through those bars somehow, that'd be great. Okay, I'll just run through this. Now I have direction, now that I got the sleeping stone. I, st I, I, I would keep the sleeping stone, would I not? I kept the key. Good. Oh. How considerate. Although, in retrospect, I can now switch over to Type 7. That is pretty cool, being able to refill your inventory at will, as long as you have access to an exit. Be damn sure you have access to an exit. To my left. God, I hate this place. So much potential for creepiness.
Okay. I guess I have no choice but to go up. There's nothing at that save lantern, is there? No, okay. No, indeed. Yeah, what's up with that? There's like a door in the staircase that I can't open? I don't even get that. Small drawer built on the side. I, I really don't get what's up with this architecture. Okay, now how do I get to those rafters? That's what I want to know. It looks like I'm on the same floor as the rafters. So, I'm going to want to go here, the kimono room. How do I get to the kimono room again? Basically in here. Hmm, I guess that's how. So get the stairs on the other side of the hallway. Fine. You know, I'm curious. Oh, seriously? Oh. So it tricked me out. But it actually did have something inside. Creepy freaking closet, I hate you. Yep, yeah, still got that blocked off. But there's the other stairs. I really hope those boss ghosts I fought stay dead. And I don't mean the uh, the ones that dispel the talismans, I mean like Holly. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I already fought this ghost. Disgusting thing. Good. Okay, so I followed this up here. That's where I want to go. So go left and around. Well, I guess this isn't so bad. I also want to find that projector room if I can. Oh, it's right there. Well, sure, I'll take. I'll. I'll stop in. Maybe I can get another clue. I am lacking those, and I'm also just checking for items. Eh, do it the best way. Okay, nothing for sure. I don't like that cold air stuff either. I do, however, like the fact that my health reset. Alright, let's watch ourselves a film. Now, where the hell were they? I think I fought that one corner hallway. Didn't I fight that? I'm clearly missing something. Definitely fought that guy by the jars. Hmm. These clues are disappointingly vague. Now, I want to go to Holly's room. Th okay. That was right behind me. Of course I'm facing the wrong door, I'm a freaking idiot. Okay. Like, some of those rooms seem so obvious, like I must have been there before, but I'm just not getting it. Yeah, definitely got into a fight over here, pretty sure.
This is the way to Holly's place. I'm just gonna run to the corner. I, re I really don't understand why they would have just that extended dead end. I keep saying that, but you know, it keeps being true. Now... Good. Maybe this is my problem. There. Let's do it. I sure hope this is the right door, because if not, I'm going to be very disappointed. Oh my god, are you serious? The thing fights? I never thought I'd fight here. Jeez! Haha! <laughs> you like that? I used the blast! Ah! I can't believe I'm fighting here. What an awkward place to be. tricky. I think the creepiest part is how she uh, smiles as she's about to stab you. Do you see that look on her face when I got a picture of her? Yeah, look at that face. Oh, premature. Got her anyway. I must be going the right way if I'm fighting a boss. Oh, nice! So maybe I was going to the wrong sleeping stone door after all, but at least now I can definitely open this one. Unless this door needed two sleeping stones? I don't even know. Ugh, that angle. And you know, I wonder if that ghost I got a while back from that peephole was part of my spirit list. The answer is yes. All remain to sacrificial pillars. Okay. Moving on. Oh, that's right. I got a double back. Here we go. Right, right, right. But where do I ultimately want to go is the question. That's definitely right. Oh, I think I see. I did something wrong. Yep. Yep, blew that one. Okay, let's try this. One. Two. Oop. Okay, one. One, two, one, two, bingo. All I have to do is move everything the maximum number of times they will allow. I finally understand. Now where am I? Wooden figure room. That's pretty creepy. It looks like he's not going to do anything. Oh. Oh boy. <laughs> Oh, 
I guess it was worth it. I don't even know. Back at I go. Which means there's another sleeping stone door, but where? The plot thickens. Man, Fatal Frame 3 so far is definitely the most... It's the one that's had me fight in the most awkward of places. On these freaking rafters, I can't even believe it. Okay, that takes care of that. And the question is, where do I go? I guess now that I have a sleeping stone, when I recheck it... Another survivor. Ugh. I suppose I activated somebody below me? What's below me? Oh, the cross hallway. Good. I'll see if I can't run over there. It's actually not far away at all. Whoa. Oh, okay. The door looked like another scorch mark. I'm gonna head out now. Back the way I came so I can enter the cross hallway and then hit the save point. Thought the wall looked a little strange, pardon me. The cross hallway is back through here. Yeah. And then I'll check the projection room. And then I'll head back up to the save room. Sounds like a deal? Please. Oh, come on. kick your ass. How about you, tough guy? Where you going? Where you going? What the hell? I'm gonna kick your ass. Oh, that is unforgivable. <laughs> I'm gonna enjoy this. Piss off. Oh, I'm going to enjoy this. A little too much, I think. Ugh. Yeah, Jake! These ghosts play rough, I'm not going to lie. I saw that other one coming. I even saw him coming at the last second. Let's go ahead and there we go. Nice open area. What? Whoa! It's amazing how sick I am of this. I'm going to enjoy ending this guy. So he's all getting slick. Ducking down. How about your friend? Not so tough when there's only one of you. Am I right? Am I right? Ah, oh, lost it. That's okay. Let's do it again. Idiot. Bet you're pretty proud of yourselves. I wonder if the door's open now that I destroyed the presences. R nice! I can actually go in. So much for going around the other side.
Hmm. And there's another way out. I wonder if I can go in that way. Well, this is gonna piss you off a lot, but I'm actually... What? In order to keep the rift... Aha. Uh -huh. So I'll fight this guy and then... Whoa, hello. So I'll fight this guy and then save. How about that? That was my blast. Ah, oh, I lost it. Yikes. Oh, I think I missed him. Damn. Whoa, did he just like stab me and pull the knife out? That's badass. Too bad I like can't handle this guy. <laughs> Oh, bad angle. I'm sitting right in the wall. Here we go. This is better. Yes! And, of course, the book. Top shrine carpenters have been gathered together to seal the Kuze shrine into the depths of a great cavern so that not even a single ray of light can enter into the darkness. Then we must erect a shrine of the rift in front of the great cavern, using spirit trees as the core pillars, and with sacrificial pillars arranged so that the darkness is purified and the rift cannot leak into the world. R flash? What does that do? Repels ghosts, banishes weak ghosts by pressing circle. I may get a shutter chance, but some are immune to repelling. When you've been caught by a ghost, your timing with the circle button is good, you can evade. When you wait for a dream, your flash is restored. Look at that, I got four flashes. That's pretty cool. That's a whole different mechanic. Now, I would explore more of the room, but I'm already going over time here, so I'm going to run to the save room. I'll see if I can't take the care of the projector next time. This is fun, I gotta say. And the ghosts are deliciously challenging. I lose track so easily, it's embarrassing. Good, I'm doing it right. So now I get to go back into that big room. Actually, you think the last ghost is here? There's one of the most pictured in front of all those stalks, I wonder. Maybe not. Good. I'm not ready for him. Okay. And with that, I can cut the installment. Well, we certainly made a lot of progress today, didn't we? At first, I gotta admit, it was a lot of wandering around to trying to find anything. But when we did find something, yeah, it didn't seem like it had mounted to much. We checked a, a room and we found a ghost that was worth points, I guess. Thanks a lot. But it turned out that that opened the door that we've been trying to open this entire time. The one that had been held from the other side. And then we got the third of the four ghosts that are required to open that door. We really are moving along. We even got a new ability for our camera, the flash ability. I'm going to have to test that out. I can't wait. Until next time, everyone.